Oh, yes, yes, yes. I'm so glad you could come back and join us for another experiment. Well, if you've watched our other video, you certainly know that we are talking about the Gulf of Mexico and uh, the oil spill that's occurred there right now. And uh, we're going to look at different ways to actually see what we can do to clean this up uh, here from our simulated oil spill. So if you do want to try these experiments at home, certainly please do not use a fish tank. Ideally, what you need is uh, a bowl like this or a clear uh, Pyrex bowl. But please make sure you ask mum or dad as well before you go ahead and do this experiment. In fact, you can actually do it with them. You might even teach them something. What else do we need? Well, we need some paper towel. Uh, you can certainly try some string as well. And you're also going to need some cotton balls. So what we're going to try and do is actually move some of this oil and contain it into a certain area. Out there in the Gulf of Mexico right now, they use these things called booms. These booms stretch around the oil and what they can do is they can pull it together and bring the oil into a certain area to be able to later on to be able to absorb that oil from the water. So first things first, let's try and make a boom. So here we have is some paper towel. What you're going to do is take a couple of sheets and what ideally what you want to be able to do is uh, roll it in. So we have a piece just like this. So you roll it up. And then what you're going to do is you're going to place our paper towel boom into our oil. And you're going to move it very, very slowly and see what happens. Are you ready? I'm going to place it into the oil. I'm going to move it. And you can actually see what we're doing here is I'm moving majority of the oil here towards the back of my fish tank and then this is where they would actually be able to uh, skim it out of the water it makes it a little easier to skim it when it's in a concentrated area like that as well so that works just great now obviously we're here we're in simulating this inside obviously out in the gulf you've got the waves and the weather that affects that which makes it a little more difficult but over time doing these uh, things over and over um, it certainly uh, works a little bit better than what we've done there so what else could we do well uh, they have things called uh, skimmers okay these boats are uh, special boats that actually skim the water uh, it's a little bit like a ladle and a soup pot actually they actually pull the water and the oil out and um, we're going to try that and we're going to try using something like a cotton ball and see if that actually works. So we're going to take this and what we are actually doing is absorbing some of the oil into the cotton ball. Of course, this wouldn't be that effective out in the Gulf of Mexico because uh, you would need a very, very large ship indeed and lots and lots of cotton wool. But what these scientists and engineers are doing is they've used things like uh, cotton ball, like pillowcases that actually soak up the oil. So what I suggest you do at home is you can try this experiment yourself and maybe even use pieces of string like this and maybe contain the oil and see what you can do to move the oil around inside your very own experiment. So good luck. Uh, again, make sure you ask mum and dad and uh, enjoy learning. I'm Professor Tinkermeister. See you soon.